score was 99.83 in 2011 and these are my credentials now when you use my code nln10 yes you will get 10 percentage discount and you will get guidance of all these subjects from me now why me i'm ranked 33 in overall category of gate and dsc and ranked one in math and chemistry category i have dealt more than 50000 plus students till date for at upsc and gate and dsc right many students were asking me what is the difference between iconic and plus and what are the advantages when we choose iconic or plus now most of the students know this in iconic you will be assigned with a personal coach exclusively now how this coach will be helpful he will be giving you the best study plan and for every topic you will be getting specialized notes and practice sets course fine the most important part of this coach how he will be helpful is personalized test analysis 90 percent of the students complain one thing right sir we are not able to apply the things of what we are studying right so even though after completing the entire syllabus now this is where your coach will be helpful each and every test will be analyzed and your mistakes are identified and they are rectified so that your score will be boosted one more advantage when you choose iconic you will be getting one to one live mentorship with your educator and mentor so that you can speak with them personally about your difficulties facing you'll get the best solutions for that whatsoever right regarding your test preparation whatsoever one more advantage when you choose iconic you will be getting access to complete raudra coding classes where you can prepare for all your software courses of course whatever you get in plus you will get in iconic also in plus the classes will be on live pattern which will be completely structured right you can choose your own courses and batches according to your need comprehensive course crash course right rank improvement batches weekly tests are available quizzes are available you can access them unlimitedly how much you have to invest if you are choosing plus and if you are opting for 24 month subscription it will be costing you on an average of 58 rupees per day the lowest where you will get india's the best educators to teach for you now when you use my code nln10 you will get my guidance my entire group guidance right from bima sir vishal sir negi sir finally to me and you will get 10 percentage discount after 10 percentage discount the price will be 42 480 and for 12 months it will be 29205 after discount and which is for 18 months coming to iconic it will be 5805 after discount when you use my code nln10 for 12 months this is for 18 and 24 months of course last one hour to get this incredible offer right the price is going to hike tomorrow you will be getting on an average of 26 percentage offer right and the price are at the lowest those who are serious and even trying to subscribe now do try it right now right before 11 59 pm today okay and you will be getting notes for gate and esc right now for the plus subscribers and we have shared the demo uh notes also check the quality which was prepared by top educators in india Chalo. next one so let's start with the uh set here aram sir right read the set i'll explain you in detail the high low game is a four player game played in six rounds there are totally four players and this game is played in six rounds high low game it seems in every round each player chooses to bid high or low each player every player the bids are made simultaneously same time if all the bid if all the four bid high then all the four lose one point each now this i will write down neatly ma then we can understand this so there are four players now i'll write down this point if all the four players bid high h h there are four players now so automatically will they gain point or will they lose point all four lose one point each it seems so minus one minus one i'll write down this one minus one minus one okay let's come to the next one if three players bid high if three players bid high and one bid low then the players bidding high gain one point each and the player bidding low loses three points it seems so three high one low i'll write down h h h now what happens here and one low the one who bids high will get one point gains one point i'll write down here one and the one who bid low will lose three points minus three come to the next one right uh then 
if three players are then if two players bid high and two players bid low then the players bidding high gain two points and each and players bidding low lose two points each it seems so uh, two highs and two lows h h l l you closely observe there the one who bids high will get two points the one who bids low will get minus two points perfectly done Let's come to the next point that if one player bids high and three bid low, then the player bidding high gains three points and the one and the players bidding low lose one point each it seems. So one high, three low. L, L, L. Now high will gain three points it seems and the remaining one will lose one point. Come to the last one. If all the four bid low, then all the four gain one point each, it seems. If all the persons bid low, so I don't this one. Low. All the persons will gain one point, it seems. So see here, all these guys will do simultaneously, not one by one. Right? One, two, three, four play. All the four players will do at a time, at a second, right? Okay. So done. So this is one point that I want to write down. Now any other point given there? Four players Arun, Ban Kim, Charu and Deepak played the high-low game. The following facts are known about their game it seems. Okay, fine. At the end of the three rounds, at the end of the three rounds, Arun had scored six points, Deepak had scored two points, Ban Kim and Charu had scored minus two points each it seems. So I'll write down in uh, next slide. So, uh, I'll write down the first round here, second round here, third round here. After the third round, I'll write down the points here. Uh, after completion of third round, or third round point, after completion of third round, this is the point given there. At the end of three rounds, right? So, I'll write down here. So, uh, the players are, I'll write down here, Arun, Ban Kim, Charu, ah, Charu, Charu, and who is that? This one, Deepak. So six, it seems. I'll write down here. Ah, ah, so I'll write down the points here. Six points by Arun. Ah, uh, Ban Kim minus two points. Charu minus two points. Deepak. Two points. Is this the given there? Yes. Bankim and Charu score minus two. Yes, this is the point. Let's come back. At the end of six rounds, Arun had scored seven points. Bankim and Deepak had scored minus one point, and Charu had scored minus five points. It seems. So I'll write down four, five individual round points. Also, I'll write down one. Don't worry about that. Four, five, six. After completion of sixth round, I'll write down in black ink. Arun scored 7 points it seems. So Ban Kim scored minus 1 according to the data. Charu scored minus 5 and Deepak scored minus 1. Is it? Let's check and come back. Ban Kim and Deepak scored minus 1. Charu scored minus 5. So first and second points are over. Let's come back and check third point. Deepak's score in third round was less than his score in the first round. By this, what can I write? I'll write down about Deepak there. Deepak's third round score was less than first round. Matlab, first round score is greater than 3. Any other point given there? Yes. But was more than his score in the second round, it seems. So, third round score is greater than second round. Now, these are this is the point that we have to take on. Observe this point carefully and this will be helpful to solve the question there. Let's come back and this is also done. In exactly, in exactly, in exactly two out of the six rounds, in exactly two out of the six rounds, Arun was the player who bid high. Arun was the only player, right? So means you closely observe there, he is the only one who bid high, remaining one will be low. Okay, that's the logic there here. Uh, let's come back and uh, we will see the data there one second. Uh, the one thing that the logic that you have to crack here is you closely observe there ma all these persons will do simultaneously na means by the end of the round 
whatsoever first or second or third or four or five or six what is the point change happens there the point change is minus four here you closely observe there the point change is how much here zero there here the point change is how much here zero there here the point change is how much there zero there here the point change is how much four points there so by this at the end of any round at the end of any round the total sum of the points counted by these four players will be minus 4 r4 r0 so apart from that there will be no chance the sum of the points will be only in between these numbers there closely observe there done i hope so i am clear regarding this let's come back and check this points there now they go after three rounds arun got six points it seems ban kim got minus two c Charu got minus 2 and Deepak, Deepak got 2 points there. And again, 1 point there. Arun is the only one who have bidded high in a round at 6. Now, closely, what is the change between this 4th and 6th round? Only 1 point. Only 1 point. Is there any chance of 2 highs there? In between 4th round and 6th round, there is no chance of Arun having 2 highs in between fourth and sixth round it has to be damn surely between one two three rounds only you should accept that am i right or wrong plus or no only one high so how many only one highs chances are there only one high means uh, is this two yes i'm right underlining this in means means damn surely ah uh, no two highs is not this one ma exactly two highs means uh, exactly one high means this is the only chance na? so two times this should happen in first second third round am i right or wrong in the first second third round either in one or two or three this should happen am i right or wrong yes uh closely observe this am i right or wrong yes perfectly done uh is there any other thing that we can do it there hi uh any other any other any other any other is there any chance of two things there no is it is it the only chance no ma'am i cannot damn surely assure this one so i'll go back this one regarding this so three minus one minus one okay now what about the remaining things See here, if I take only 2-6 there, let us suppose take 2-6, what about the third round? Arun has to lose somewhere, either gain or lose. So, it will be more than 6 now. So, 2-3s cannot be possible. That you have to take down this point there, damn surely, right? So, I hope so, you got my point clearly. You cannot get this H triple L 2 times because if I write down 2 times there here, One second, ma. One second, one second. It's not crashed. there then uh, now closely observe there if i take down one h triple three l's two times what about third round you yeah, cannot make it directly six one point has to be loosed or one point has to be gained and again they go there you add this you add this uh layer there after three rounds what will be the point there you closely observe there minus two minus two will become minus four six plus two eight so automatically some of the points will be at the point called four am i right or wrong you closely observe there at last some of the points after three rounds is it four yes perfectly it is four done so at last finally i have to so my by this by this what can i say individually if i add my rounds there individually if i add and add my rounds there it has to equal to four what are the choices there to become 4? 
4 comma 0 comma 0 is one chance if I add this or otherwise you take there uh, 4 comma minus 4 comma 4 must be the chance there am I right or wrong in this case only you can be become 4 there now you closely observe there can I take 4 comma minus 4 comma 4 because see here so there is no 1 H there there is no 1 H there in this combination so I cannot take this combination because Arun scored Arun is the only one who scored high in the first second or third round so my combination will be 4 comma 0 comma 0 so I have to take this combination so coming back I will take this combinations here here 4 comma 0 comma 0 ah, now what will be the chance there please let I will write down this 4 comma 0 comma 0 4 comma 0 comma 0 means uh, 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 in this 3 I have to take 1 in this 3 I have to take 1 yes and they go and finally what my conclusion is I cannot take two highs here also see first of all I'll write down this one one four is there damn surely now so how can I take that four there so damn surely Arun's score has to be three so I'll take down like this three minus one minus one minus one okay now you closely observe this is Arun Bankim Charu okay fine whatsoever the round I will take down like this will then later on I will shift it now this is automatically 0 am I right or wrong? 1 0 is over 1 4 has to be done and again Deepak's score has to be uh, managed like this so can I take down like this one second 2 comma uh, minus 2 comma minus 2 comma 2 I can take down like this and this one is 0 so automatically this has to be damn surely your 4 if 4 means it has to be 1 1 1 1 means low 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 now add this all together did Arun's score became 6 yes and they go your Deepak's round values also managed there Deepak round 1 score is 2 round 3 score is 1 2 is greater than 1 and round 3 score is greater than minus 1. Now this is the logic there. I hope so you got my logic there. So I will write down the same thing there. So one second in black ink and blue ink right. Blue ink. This is 2. So I have rearranged this. This is minus 2. This is minus 2. And this is 2. And this is 3. And this is minus 1. This is minus 1. This is minus 1. Now this is third round how much more? 1, 1, 1, 1. You closely observe there 1 minus 1 goes away 2 came there. A minus, minus 1, minus 2, minus 3, minus 2 there. Minus 2, minus 1 again same minus 2 there. 2, 3, 2, 1 worked out there. Am I right or wrong? Perfectly worked out there. Exactly done. As I have done this, now you have to help me in 4, 5, 6. Now see, only one point rise is there. And again, they go by this only one H happened in second round. And there is only one H in Arun must happen between 4, 5, 6. And you closely observe there, add these entire things. I will write down in black. 7 uh, minus 5 will be 2. Minus 1 minus 1 will be minus 2. And this became 0. Okay. Uh, now automatically 0 matlab. Damn surely all the three things must be zero. Am I right or wrong? All the three things must be zero. Or otherwise, all the th four comma minus four minus four. No, this doesn't happen there. All the things has to be damn surely zero only, right? Because four comma minus four comma zero can also be happen. So they go, am I right or wrong? Minus seven, zero, zero, zero. Or four comma minus four, zero should happen. Either two choices there. Can I take 4 comma minus 4 comma 0? Because if I take 4 comma minus 4, the raise here is only one point there. I cannot take down all those points like this. So chalo, one one uh, uh only one one high way must be there. Now I'll take down this fourth round as one high. Three. If I take down four as one high, this minus one, minus one, minus one. There is no need to change the names also. I write down like this. Uh three minus 1 minus 1 
माइनस वन फोर फाइव सिक्स फोर्थ राउंड एंड देखो ओनली वन पॉइंट शुड इंक्रीज देर ऑलरेडी नाइन पॉइंट सो डैम श्योरली दिस हैज टू बी माइनस वन दिस हैज टू बी माइनस वन आई होप सो यू गॉट माई पॉइंट देर राइट इफ दिस इज माइनस वन माइनस वन वॉट विल बी द पॉइंट लेफ्ट ओवर देर देर देखो दाई इट हैज टू बी थ्री ओनली ना एम ए राइट आर रॉन्ग यस परफेक्टली नसियर दिस हैज टू बी माइनस वन this has to be minus 1 so what are the points left over there can anybody say so see here i'll take down this as minus uh okay this is minus 2 okay fine we are right you have to add this points also na minus 2 minus 4 okay fine minus 1 minus 1 okay fine now closely observe there minus 2 minus 1 minus 4 totally minus 4 this has to be minus 1 so this value has to be damn surely 3 and you closely observe there minus 2 minus minus 4 this has to be minus 1 and minus 1 minus 1 or 2 automatically it became 0 now this has to be minus 1 perfectly all the rounds were exactly done there without any issues then again i got my value there 7 comma my black things are after 6 after 6th round This is after third round, perfectly done without any mistake there. Take on, chalo. Then do try to let us solve the questions there. Next we will solve the questions there. Come to the first one. What is the first one? What were the bids by Arun, Bankim, Charu, and Deepak in the first round? In the first round, right? What is this? Two comma minus two comma minus two. Two comma minus two comma minus two. H. Ah, uh, okay. This is H, low, low, H L H double L H. Is there any option there? H double L H. Yes, yes. And my fourth option, exactly two. Let's come to the second one. In how many rounds? In how many rounds did Arun bid high? In how many rounds did Arun bid high? Let's come back and check there. Arun, ah, uh, bid high here first round, here second round. Here third round, fourth round, now fifth and sixth he did bid high, so totally four rounds. My option is four rounds. Perfectly done. Now, as I have solved this second one, I am expecting you guys to solve this one here. Third one. Ah, uh, I'll I'll do the ah uh, third one right. Ah, uh, in how many rounds did Bankim bid low? In how many rounds did Bankim bid low? Let's come back. Balkim, Balkim bid low. One, two, no, three, four. Totally four rounds. Yes or no? Totally four rounds. Balkim bid low. Yes, four rounds. Come to the next one. In how many rounds did all four players make identical bid? It seems, ma. In all uh, identical bids. Now come back and check their identical bids. In how many rounds did all four players make identical bids? In the third round they made identical bids, and in fifth round they made identical bids. Am I right or wrong? Yes, perfectly. So totally, your answer will be two rounds. So I am expecting you guys to answer this fifth question here. Ah, uh, uh, yes, fifth question. I'll be giving you two minutes. Try this. Let's see how many can solve this. any answers for this
फोर्टी सेकेंड्स में और यार बड़ी क्या हुआ राइट इन हाउ मेनी राउंड्स डिड दीपक गेन एग्जैक्टली वन पॉइंट No answers for this. Now see, you can go back to the point. Exactly one point it seems. Hmm. Bolo. Here Deepak scored exactly one point only in one round. That is your third round. You can check there. All the things are minus one only and two. So in only one round. That is your third round. Come to the next one. Do try to solve this one, and this is little bit a uh, tricky one when compared to all others. Try this. And which of the following rounds was Arun definitely the one player to bid high? In which of the following rounds was Arun definitely the only player to bid high? Only player. Any answers for this? No answers. Yeah, what? In how many of the following rounds was Anil, as a Arun, right? Only to bid high. Let's check. Go back to the things there. Only to bid high. Now see here, there are two persons. Here, second round, only one person. This is the only one person, right? And again, here all the persons bid high. Here, fourth round also he is the only one to bid high. Five, six. So fourth, in which of the following was Arun definitely the only player to bid high? Ah, yes. The point here is definitely it seems, ma'am. So this round values might go up and up. See, this fourth round might be fifth round. This fifth round might be sixth round. So I cannot damn surely say this is fourth round. Now you got the point there. Vice versa, right? You can do it anyway. You will get the final answer as seven only, right? After six rounds. So it is not damn surely fourth round. Man. This values can go. This values can be in fifth round. Fifth value round values can be in sixth round. Right? Sixth value rounds can be in fourth round. Fourth value round can be in sixth round. At last, finally, your seven minus one minus five minus one will get valid there. This is the logic there. Now you closely observe there. Perfectly done. So by this, what can I say? Only in the second round he has bid only one. Done. Perfectly done. I hope so. I am clear regarding this, right? So this is one of the finest puzzle. Do try to solve this type of puzzles. I'll come up with one more extraordinary puzzle there.
So tomorrow I'll make it 99, day after tomorrow I'll make it as 100 for sure here. So challenge. Now, as you all know, I deal with CAT, UPSC and GATE and ESC category. If you wish me as your guide, you can use my code NLN10 for plus subscription. You can use my code NLN10 for iconic subscription. Listen, there is 29 minutes more, right? To get subscribed. Use my code and subscribe and beat the price hike, right? You can use my code on NLN10 to unlock combats. So you can use my code NLN10 to unlock free classes, which happens on an academy. The price per plus for 12 months will be 29205 after discount when you use my code NLN10, and this is for 18 and 24 months. Coming to Iconic, it will be 5805 after discount when you use my code NLN10 for 12 months and this is for 18 and 24 months. Yes, and coming to here, right? Yes, beat the price hike. Tomorrow is the price hike and today you will be having 26% discount, 20 minutes more. Do try to subscribe and tomorrow onwards the price goes. The price will be hiked. Only 20 minutes more. And what my suggestion is, what I mean, you need not wait for any any educator to help you, my right? You we have an extraordinary wing called an academy. Ask a doubt. You just click the picture of the doubt, upload in doubts and solutions, select your preferred language, get the video solution of that question there. Perfectly, you can do it. And do try to attend my campus placement strategy sessions where I will help you. All right with best questions from different different companies right as i am doing i have done 120 sessions on campus placements right this is my track record regarding this campus placement do try to attend this on special classes right where the interaction will be 10x more than on youtube and it will be a gamified environment there do try to join this telegram group so that we will get all the updates regarding the classes and the courses and please do try to hit the like button share it so that i can reach to more number of audience if you like the session there right Subscribe to the channel, download the PDFs and hit the bell icon. Thank you and have a nice day. It's time to experience something glorious. Unacademy combat. Compete, crack, conquer. A challenging get contest engineered to give you an experience like none other. Where you put your knowledge to test. And battle it out with the best. To bring out the best in you. Unacademy combat is the most competitive gamified contest for date till date with the best of the questions by best educators with detailed video solutions from top educators right after each contest combat live with peers to get real-time rankings and win big participate in every contest to improve your ratings challenging contests every fortnight or alternate sunday live ranking after every question big rewards for top rankers your passion to crack gate deserves this your hard work towards your dream deserves this fuel your inner fire for the ultimate gate challenge unacademy combat register now